Hey, what's up travelers? In this video, we're going to Landmark 81, the second tallest building in Southeast Asia. And then after that, we're gonna go find some snails at one of the top places to get snails in all of Saigon. So stick around. The Landmark 81 building is the second tallest building in all of Southeast Asia, and it's number 17 in the entire world. And we're about to go to the top. <laughs> so almost as soon as I got up here, the fire alarm went off. And yeah, that was kind of insane. I didn't know if I needed to exit the building or not. Uh, <laughs> but the security guard was running around looking to see where it was coming from, but he didn't seem like he was too panicked, so I just didn't lose my cool. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's head on up further. They say this is the best spot for the sunset, but I think we're here way too early for that. <laughs> the way over there, we've got the airport. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a plane taking off right there. virtual reality experience here. So I'm standing outside on the 81st floor of the Landmark 81 building and uh, behind me 
This is about as, as high as you can get in the building. Um, there are some, some floors above, but they don't let you go up there. They don't even let you go up there. <laughs> but uh, behind me, across the river, we have the Bedetsko Financial Tower, which the first time I came to Saigon, that was the tallest building in Southeast Asia. Uh, and that was not quite a long time ago, almost eight, nine years ago. Needless to say, a lot of things have changed. All right, let's go get some snails. We are deep in the heart of District 3, and we are on our way to a little street stall restaurant that serves snails called Oklon. And uh, this is one of the top-rated seal places in all of Saigon, and I am so excited. I can't wait to go eat some food here. All right, so we are here. I just ordered a couple things of snails. I got one that's a really big one, and then I got some uh, little tigery kind of snails, uh, and of course a chada, which is iced tea. So I'm pretty excited about that. We might end up getting some more. So I found out about this place uh, back when I was here. In 2020, during COVID times, uh, it was one of the first times that Max McFarland and I uh, got together and went out to eat. So we ended up coming here. We had an amazing time here. Uh, the, the owner is just super cool. He just he realized we were recording uh, for for Max's channel when we when we uh, when we were doing that. And the next thing I know, he just more and more uh, plates were just coming to the table. It was ridiculous. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is so exciting. I can't wait to eat. So we got this first plate of these snails. Man, these things look absolutely amazing. They are not easy to pick up with the chopsticks, so we're not even going to try. And just like that, we've got both of what, uh, the plates that we ordered. We may end up getting some more stuff. I don't know. We will find out. But Now, look at that piece of conch right there. Woo -wee! That thing looks absolutely fantastic. Woo! Just off of that first little taste, I got a little bit of spice that cut right down my throat. Oh man, this is gonna be good. Oh. Oh man. 
that is phenomenal. The texture is just, it's soft and springy, kind of like, almost, almost like a super, super hard jello. Oh man, that is good. And then it's got that, that chili flavor, and then there's a sweetness to it, and, and it's got a pretty amazing funkiness to it as well. And, uh, yeah, it, you know, it's actually almost like, like a biting into a really high-end mushroom. Mm. Oh, that is so amazing. That is truly, truly what we came here for. Oh, man, that is so good. I could eat that every day. All right, let's 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 try one of these other snails that, that we were trying to get before we got the other one on the table here. Okay, yeah, so that's that's what that looks like. We got the snail fork here. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, the textures of that one, that's more, more of the snail that you would figure you were going to get. Kind of, kind of hard, and chewy, but uh, the sauce that they're cooked in, it's a, uh, it's kind of a salty, sweet, uh, some sort of a, I'm not sure. I think, give it another taste here. So the sauce is kind of powdery, kind of a sweet and sour. When I ordered this, I thought it was going to be some sort of a tamarind sauce, but uh, I was wrong. I, I think this is uh, some sort of a some sort of a sweet chili sauce. Uh, it is very interesting, that's for sure. So so good. All right, so here we got the the foot of that conch here. <laughs> this should be interesting. Man. That is just so good. This, that conch right there was worth the, t the ticket to fly here to Vietnam in the first place by itself. Out of all the other things that I've had to eat here since I've been here, this is the number one thing that I've had. And I... Do not say that lightly because I've had some really amazing things here. These little snails are kind of a pain in the ass, though. <laughs> but, yeah, they're super good, too. They are just, they're a little bit harder to eat, but no, so, so worth it. I mean... They got a lot of different snails over there. Some of them are bigger than others. This is a good medium-sized one. There is one over there that they uh, they grind it up and then they, they put it in with some, some pork meat and then they use a little bit of lemongrass and then they cook it. And that way they cook it in the shell with all of that and then lemongrass, you use it to pull it out and they have this awesome snail meatball. Yeah, I haven't had one of those since I've been here in Vietnam this time, but they are amazing too, and I can't wait to have them. In that conch, it's 150,000 dong. I think the, the other plate of snails is another 150,000 dong. I'm not 100% sure on that one. But, but if I was to guess, that's how much that would be. So I am starting to fill up here. Um, and my appetite still is really really underwhelming right now uh, but yeah so i've got about six of these little snails left i got a little bit more of that uh, that conch to go we're just gonna go ahead and call this a video if you've enjoyed this video go ahead and like subscribe hit that notification bell if you're into it 
And uh, as always, eat great food. Thank you.